This documentary is about um, it's about family. You know, this family, uh, Carmen and Sergio, are both um, parents and shamans, and they've got three um, teenage kids, uh, uh, Valentin and two and Lua, which uh, any other teenage kid anywhere else, they are getting addicted to technology, you know, like Netflix, smartphones, um, and the rest. And uh, Carmen and Sergio uh, decided at some point, you know, uh, seeing how technology was affecting, you know, uh, the family and the relationships, you know, between them as a couple, between their kids, uh, to take, you know, um, the family, embark on a, on a thousand mile uh, road trip uh, into the Amazon uh, to a place where they used to live, a place where they used to have a different relationship with nature, with each other. So kind of uh, hoping that they could get back to that, you know, maybe perhaps happy world in a way, and find, you know, uh, connect uh, with nature and each other during this journey, and find also um, uh, some kind of balance to, 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 to understand better how they can uh, manage better their ancestral beliefs and their uh, urban life. Oh, well, first was very strange. For me, it was like, why he want to do a documentary about my family? And I, what we will show, uh, what supposedly we will have to share, I, I, I don't understand why. And when, when I met him and we did these different ceremonies in Lago Titicaca, Titicaca Lake, and also in Puno, we connected in another level where I could have enough trust in himself and to accept the purpose, even if I not was very clear about why, but trusting that he has a good soul, good intentions. Uh, it's not easy to show who I am and my life because it's different, and I was always trying to care my, my family from the judgments of the rest of the society because we are different, you know, and I like to be different and I like to to make my own choice choices, not uh, to guide my life for the idea of the others ones. You know? and, but after to share with him and connect with this guy and see that he is really a good guy, I said, and he said that we have something to show that will help another people to know that there are more possibilities in their life. And this inspired me and I said, okay, let's do it. It was four years um, uh, shooting at different points, you know, like you know, like three weeks or two weeks or or six weeks, and the core of the of the documentary, the the, the, the main road trip that you, you get to see there, it was um, six weeks, you know, all together, you know, the, the longest kind of time, you know, the production. You know, when somebody comes to your life and says that we'll do a documentary about your family, and you trust. You imagine that something will happen, but you never imagine that one day you will be in Edinburgh, you know, in a festival and people making you interviews about your life and your family is very uh, strange. Um, but at the same time, I am grateful because it's uh, one opportunity to share my opinion about the, the, the main, about many things. And this is one blessing that not all the people have, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm very grateful. <laughs>